killer frost. Seriously, I can't take it anymore. Uh, Caitlin, is everything... Oh, alter ego confab. <laughs> seen enough episodes of Sister Sister to recognize a sibling spat when I see one. Oh. So, I'm trying to help Cisco with his metahuman cure, but every time I start working on it, Killer Frost takes over and messes with my equations. Uh, like this. She changed all my heterozygotes into asterisks. Oh, I thought those were just tiny snowflakes. <sighs> so she's not on board, or...? No, and I don't exactly know why. Can't you just ask her? Oh, I've tried, but every time we start talking about it, she starts singing Barney's I Love You song. Ooh, that's cold. Yeah. What about Cisco? Is he having any luck? Not yet. He went to the Tannhauser offsite so he could concentrate. He says it's quiet there. Yeah, quiet like a tomb. So I think if I can isolate the genetic marker that bonds human DNA to dark matter, I can reverse engineer the process and unravel it to create a cure. That's great. Yeah, except I need meta-DNA that hasn't fully bonded with dark matter yet. Of course, because as we all know, with genetic modification, I mean, why? Because that's the only time when I can identify where the marker is in the genome. OK, so you need DNA from a metahuman who was created recently. Yeah, ideally in the last eight months. But everyone I can think of has been killed by cicada. Right. So where the heck do we look? <sighs> Flash, all new this Tuesday at 8, 7 central on The CW.